chances. Can he create a little bit of magic here for York United? Mo Babuli, he's done it! He's found a little bit of magic. And Mo Babuli has given the nine stripes the lead with three minutes to go before half time. Ingham's wall didn't get their angles right. Mo Babuli opens the scoring. Sunshine in Langley. Romeo again. Daly helps it forward. Dan Clark has scored, has he? He has, you know. And the Dutch defender is all smiles. His teammates congratulate him. He stayed forward after the set piece and was on the spot when he was needed to be. And Dan Klomp has put the Cavs back in front against Vancouver FC. It's Kwok, the substitute. Crawford outside him. Goes inside, turning Kantav. Back for Garcia. He's got a decent left peg. He scored. Renan Garcia. And we are going to have a grandstand finish. Carducci couldn't get there. And the veteran Brazilian reduces the arrears in stoppage time. Cavalry 2, Vancouver 1. And Carducci, I don't think he sees it. That's an incredible strike. Help, 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 help. He's trying to slide York United around the Pacific right now. Advantage being played as Reed had to work for that one. Now on Bohesi! something for them so they are having some success with that direct attack right now. Right for but that's not you don't come into this team with the ownership that they have with the signings that they made around the staff and not have those high expectations this is heard a call josh heard a wonder strike to take the lead right back for pacific 24th minute of the match a third goal and the pendulum has swung back in favor of pacific as Josh Hurd gets the better of his former teammate, his second of the year is a peach. 2-1 to Pacific. Infield it goes to Shome. Moosey, wrong leg, wants it on his left leg again, doesn't he? Tries it with his right, doesn't need his left leg. Fantastic finish from Ali Moosey. Five of the best from Cavalry, fine finish. And the Cavs have won it going away. Irving, no chance. Ali Moussi, the goal scorer. And Cavalry lead by five goals to one. Spaniard center back, Bassett leaves. So will be Maxime Tissot trying to test Tristan Henry. Maxime Tissot. Well, he's going to keep himself as the short option for Ali Bassett here. Yesley commands his wall. It's just a two-man wall. Bassett goes towards the near post and puts it off the glove and in. Golden Boots 
my goodness, tied for the league lead and scoring from a set piece. This game's over. Game set and match. Ottawa have got points. They probably have three. Never quite know. I expect him to try to hit it like a knuckleball now. Get it swerving. Ali Banga does hit it. What a goal! Strider two on Batty Bonga trying to thread the pass for Bevin. Lots of contact in the box. Bevin gets back to his feet and finds Daly. Here's Mercy. did well initially. Sherman Schoen took it away from him, and now here they come again, looking for the long-range shot. Oh, goodness me! What a shot that is! And what a goal, and Cavalry are back in front. Mickey Kantaf picked it up in midfield, no pressure, and decided to buy a ticket from 25 to 30 yards out. Orchestrated. Daniels, Caligari, Timoteo makes a pass across. Fernandez off oh, the post and in. It is an absolute screamer from Zachary Fernandez. A design play, but even the finish would blow the expectations of the coach that drew that. Santos escapes from all Omar, tries a shot, and that is an absolute world-class finish from Kevin Santos. Dipping and diving, swirling around, Ian Fillion, and no chance. Momentum changer, as you say, had it been three, as good as over. Salouf thought about it, might think about it now. Salouf, Salouf, oh my word, that's absolutely outstanding. Ayman Salouf does get the third in the 33rd minute, and Pacific are coasting and cruising in the capital. What a finish that was. What a great run. Well, Campo goes to ground. Some jeers from the Valor supporters. Now Polisi lining it up. Polisi! Okay, Marcello! Take a bow, young man! That is a worldie! That'll get the Valor supporters out of their seats.
35. I mean, we got the lines. We should be able to do the math. Woo! 23 minutes through the match, and the possession 74% for the Halifax Wanderers, which should surprise nobody. That's a great ball. First time at the post! Again! Di Rosario and Petrasso in the box. Back into midfield for Brem Sumaro. Brem Sumaro fires! Oh my word! Brem Sumaro, the sniper! Halfway through out of time, and he scored another worldie! He might have just won the match for York United when it looked to be at a standstill. Roll that replay, and Brem Sumaro take your curtain call. A golasso. Tristan Borges, a player known for his moments of the extraordinary from the corner flag. Service and goals. Borges tries to win it back. Tristan Borges and Olympico in extra time. She wasn't sure. Three minutes to go. Howarth, the corner from the other side. Into the wind. Yeah, what a goal. What a goal. Luke Singh. Fabulous volley. Carducci, no chance. Closing moments in Ottawa. Luke Singh, the hero. It's 1-1.